So Peloton recently released a beta for the Peloton bike tread and row that allows you to watch entertainment while you work out instead of taking a class. Now, not everyone has been put into the beta yet. So if you don't see it on your machine, don't freak out. It should be coming hopefully sooner than later. And currently there are two new options. You can either watch YouTube TV if you have a YouTube TV subscription, or you can watch shows and movies on Amazon Prime. And I know some people have been asking for this for a long Long time and others really couldn't care less. Let me know what you think, by the way, in the comments below. But what most people haven't realized yet is that you can also read books on your Peloton with this update. It's very easy to do, and I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. So first, you just need to access Amazon, which you can do once you are logged in by selecting more rides and then entertainment. Here is where you'll see the option to choose either Amazon Prime or YouTube TV. And if you want to read a book, it's going to be through Amazon and the Kindle because all you have to do once you're here is select all and then scroll down to Kindle and eBooks and finally select Kindle for web. And this will bring up your entire Kindle library. So you can just press on a book and continue reading from wherever you left off. Now you might be thinking who's going to want to read while they work out. And yes, I don't think this is going to be something that most people will use all the time. But for me personally, a large portion of my conditioning workouts are low intensity or fairly often I'll go for a quick walk on the tread. And in those cases, I absolutely see this as a great way to get in some extra reading. Also, what's nice here is that you can still do everything that you could do on a regular Kindle. So you can adjust the size and color of the font and you can make highlights to go back and see later. So just a nice little update for you book lovers out there. But as nice as this update is, I still really hope they do a bit more with it. For example, having adaptive workouts to follow along to while you watch a show would be great, which by the way, other companies like Bowflex have on their machines, or allowing access to regular YouTube instead of YouTube TV, which companies like Avron allow. But if you still really want access to Netflix on your Peloton, there is a way to do it, though it isn't the easiest thing to set up. Luckily, we have this video here, which can talk you step by step on exactly Exactly how to do it. As always, this is Colin Jenkins with Connect the Watts. Appreciate you being here, and I'll see you next time.